This week we've started on a new series on the letter of 1 Peter, and it was originally written to be read in a circuit of churches that were going through persecution. These weren't churches that Peter had preached to himself, but these were the words he felt led to write down for them. Christian communities were undergoing an experience that in a lot of ways mirrored the exiles of the Old Testament, being uprooted, scattered from their home, not really having an earthly place to call their own. And in the Old Testament, it used to be a clear sign of punishment, but now Peter's wanting them to know that they should actually see their state of exile as a confirmation of obedience. And while the familiar places of their old lives may no longer accept them, their identity is rooted in something else, which is that they are the temple. Actually, we are each a temple in which the Spirit of God dwells. Finally, Peter calls us to obedience. Obedience sets us apart from our former lives. It challenges us to understand that the more comfortable we are in this world, we compromise our loyalty to the eternal kingdom. Christianity has always been countercultural. It's always been hard. So embracing the exilic life equips us to trust in the Lord and endure whatever comes our way.